Hey, it's Devorah. All right, quick recap of the research on EFT tapping, which I talk about a lot. It is an evidence-based, really weird looking acupressure technique. If you watch my videos, you can see me kind of tapping different points on my face, on my body. It looks bizarre. I don't care because it works. And it is proven um, to help relieve anxiety, depression, PTSD, stress in general, all sorts of things. So quick recap of the actual research. I won't bore you to death, but this is the stuff that's super interesting, especially for teens, okay? This is the paper I'm looking at. It's one of my favorites. It is, I'm gonna read it to you real fast again, not boring. Clinical EFT as evidence-based practice for the treatment of psychological and physiological conditions. It is in the Journal of Psychology, if you look. Um, Really fast, super interesting stuff, okay? I'm just gonna talk today. There's a ton of stuff in this paper and there's lots more papers like it. This just happens to be my favorite because I talk about so many different things that EFT helps. Um, but I'm gonna just cover anxiety, depression, PTSD, and sports, maybe a little study skills too. There's some stuff about that. Okay, um, onwards. Let's talk anxiety really quickly. Let me find my page. Okay, here we go. Um, get this. Okay, anxiety, right? So EFT has shown efficacy in several randomized controlled trials. This is, by the way, why I love the study. Everything in here is all randomized controlled trials, which is the gold standard for research, okay? So what they found was, um, they did something with, for example, fear of public speaking with students. They found significant improvement after a 45 minute EFT session with students who had a fear of public speaking. Um, Lots of other stuff, uh, fibromyalgia sufferers, um, significant improvement in anxiety, studies of veterans, hospital patients with PTSD, um, one study of trauma survivors um, in the Congo found that EFT was as effective as CBT, cognitive behavioral therapy, for anxiety, depression, and PTSD. So that's really, really significant. Um, a lot more, but again, that's, that's just kind of a quick recap on anxiety. Depression, um, using the Beck depression inventory, which is kind of what they normally use to test depression, right? They did that and they compared people with depression using EFT and using cognitive behavioral therapy. Um, significant improvements um, when they did studies of hospital patients, veterans with PTSD, weight loss program participants where they were evaluating for depression. Um, and again, that study of Congolese trauma survivors um, found significant, significant reduction uh, in depressive symptoms, okay? Again, as effective in this case as cognitive behavioral therapy. Um, lots of stuff on phobias, I'm gonna skip that now. PTSD, um, they did a randomized control trial of abused male teenagers, found that their PTSD symptoms had been resolved in a single EFT session. I know that's crazy, okay? But there's a lot of stuff like that. EFT is a really, really powerful tool. Um, what else? There's that Congolese study. Again, um, veterans in the military. Again, significant, significant reduction in PTSD. Okay. On to sports, which is super fun. Okay. Sports and professional performance. So um, they've gotten, had a couple of randomized controlled trials on EFT for sports performance. One of them um, did a, uh, what is it? They did a EFT and placebo control group and found a performance difference of 38% after one session of EFT for um, soccer free kicks and for uh, basketball free throws. So significant, significant improvement. Um, and there's also a lot of other studies on things like golf performance and things like that. Um, there's also stuff, you know what I said, I was gonna talk about sports, but performance, so study skills, um, increased, uh, better grades. A study of university students, because everyone loves to study university students, they're like the best guinea pigs. Um, EFT reduced their anxiety, improved their test scores. Nursing students had reduced stress four weeks after learning EFT, exhibited decreases in the state of anxiety and character trait of anxiety, um, better grades, um, mental well-being and self-esteem improved significantly. Um, it's really, really cool. So again, this study is awesome, but you can just Google. You can just Google EFT tapping um, research. See what comes up. Hundreds of studies. Um, watch my other videos because I've got kind of a, a rundown. I do a little demo and I'm going to keep doing them. And especially as we're all cooped up, I'm filming this during the quarantine for, for coronavirus. Um, you know, if we're cooped up and we're kind of losing it, this is a tool that we can use uh, to feel much better. Um, this is something that's great because you could do it on your own. You don't have to tell anybody what you're working on. You can do it anywhere, anytime. 
um, and it works. So thanks for watching. Bye.